A Cake for Kate by Gretel Laura M. Kadiong. Kate was turning ten, but she was not happy. Birthdays were ordinary days for her. She never had a birthday party. She never had a cake on her birthday, but she wished she could have one. After school, she would stand near the gate to sell rice cakes that her mother made. One late afternoon, Kate saw a big box on one of the benches. She picked it up and opened it. There were glasses, spoons, and forks. There were also boxes of wristwatches, a bag of marbles, chocolates, combs, and some dresses. She closed the big box. She brought it to the principal's office. The next day, Mr. Beza, the school principal, and a lady came to Kate's class. The lady was Mrs. Salas, the owner of the box. Mr. Beza looked for Kate, and he told Mrs. Salas how Kate found the big box. Mrs. Salas thanked Kate. I just arrived from Cebu, and the things inside the box are my pasalubong for my family. She said, I was in your school because I had to fetch my nephew. Then I forgot that box. She added. Sunday came. It was Kate's birthday. After attending Mass, Kate and her mother went home. They were surprised to see Mrs. Salas waiting for them. Happy birthday, Kate, Mrs. Salas said. I brought you a gift. I asked your teacher about you, and I am happy to know that you are not only a helpful daughter, but an honest girl, too. She gave Kate a red box tied with a ribbon. Kate opened the box. What a surprise. It was a cake for her birthday. The End A Cake for Kate by Gretel Laura M. Caddyong